Hey everyone, welcome to video number eight of, um, what did I call it now? Fun with Flickers, uh, episode one, hopefully one of many, um, our very uh, first homemade wacky weekend. Um, we had, uh, Chrissy won, um, we had 217,000 points between us, but Chrissy was the one who got most of them. Good job, Chrissy. <laughs> um, and she is learning to use her Flickr as a grounding tool. And she is the first person that I'm actually giving official Flickr lessons to. And I'm so proud of her. Um, this is the second Flickr game that she's learned. And um, I just to remind everyone, um, we will be getting a Patreon together. And if anybody wants to learn the Flickr games, they can either purchase a Flickr from me uh, or they can... Um, subscribe to my uh to our patreon because the flickers um they take a lot to make and everything um and the also we need money to run this group the performers group because cat food is expensive and uh, internet is expensive and everything everything that we need in order to run this group is expensive um it costs how much, how much do these flickers cost um chrissy did a hundred dollars worth of work for hers because it's a nice plastic one and the plastic ones like it, it took, you know, it takes me, it takes me like all day to, it takes me like all day to make it, which is like, you know, a hundred dollars is, you know, if I'm going to do an eight hour work day at $15 an hour, that's pretty much what, what my time would be worth. Plus all the lessons, the whole book with all the games and all the lessons in it. Um, so, so to buy wine is $100. Yep. Now, I'm hoping that we will be able to sell, um, I'm hoping what we'll be able to sell so many that we'll be able to get equipment, like big cutters and stuff, so that we can mass produce, and then the, the price could go down. But, like, if you think of it as a grounding tool or, like, a medical device, um, I don't know how I would get this certified as a medical device, but if you think of it as something that really help you to function as a disabled person in the regular world, it's priceless, right? To have your independence is absolutely priceless, I think. But, but yeah. Um, so I'm just I'm I'm excited about I'm excited about where we're going with this um, because. Be, both of these are my life's work. The Flicker is my life's work. I've been working on it since I was 14. And um, the feline therapy is my also my life's work. I've been working on it since I was 28. And I'm 44 right now. So um, hopefully we can have one hand washing the other as far as that kind of goes. Um, but anyways, so um, hopefully we'll do more fun with Flickers. Um in the future, I think this is a really cool way to do Wacky Weekend. I don't know. What do you guys think? Do you like doing Wacky Weekend this way? Yeah. Hi, guy. Well, Hi. So, so you can either buy a Flickr or subscribe to the yep. uh, Wacky Weekend. Or to the Patreon. So I'm going to I'm gonna talk to Michelle, who is our technical officer in the performers, and we're going to get a Patreon going. So you can subscribe to Patreon. And then, like I said, if you pay, like it's five dollars a month to do Patreon, and if you stay for twenty months, I, I'll give you a Flickr, right? Because that'll be a hundred bucks. Hmm. Yeah, I like that. That sounds good. Yeah, exactly. So that's um, so that's where I'm kind of going with that, and then like I can put all the games up on Patreon, but I don't want to put them, I don't want to put them all up on YouTube because then people can make their own Flickers and and then get. Um, you know, get the games off YouTube. So I don't really want to do that, but I will put them, I will put them up on Patreon. I think I'm really excited about doing that actually. So I'm going to talk to Michelle this week and see if I can get that done. So, and hopefully, um, like I said, hopefully you guys really liked this, like this homemade wacky weekend. Um, and we, uh, I do. awesome. Thank you. Nice. Awesome. So I think, um, um, I, I think we'll be incorporating that into more and more of our um, wacky weekending. I think we'll be doing them like more and more as we, if we can, um, and then saving the like saving the ready-made stuff for times when I'm traveling or something and I can't really do one, right? 
and make it more variety. Um, well, there's also, there's always like, um, there's always helping out in other ways and earning, like she did a whole bunch of housework for me. That's how she earned hers. You know what I mean? There's always helping the group in other ways. There's always, um, if we do a contest or something, I could use it. I could offer it as a door prize or something. So, I mean, it, you know, never fear. I don't really, really, I don't really want people to not have it, even though it could really help them. Um, I don't want them to not have it because they can't afford it. Um, I, I, I would work with, I would work with anybody to try and get them one because it's, it's been a godsend for me. It's been a godsend for me for sure. Between flickers and feline therapy, it's how come I'm relatively stable. <laughs> so anywho, um, guys, this has been a an awesome experience. I love it. We're going to um, keep on with um, the training of the cats and keep on with our saga of um, keep on with flicker games. And as we are cat training, one of the things about cat training that's really important, why flickers are important to that process is because you need a lot of patience when you're going to cat train if you're training a cat you need tons of patience we didn't just slam that dog in there no we did not right you can't do that we didn't we didn't just do that but we had to we couldn't be like okay come on guys come on guys because then they're like oh yeah we know you want that so we're not going to give it to you so we had to just sit here and appear to be thinking about something completely different um and then they did what we wanted them to do and that's basically, that's one of the fundamentals of cat training, guys. And that's why flickering is so important because um, it helps us stay patient. That's one of the things that helps us stay patient, especially when we're trying to train the cat. So, um, guys, thank you guys so much for coming out to our Fun with Flickers episode one, our very first homemade wacky weekend ever as a group. So thank you very much to... Max and and Jeremy for asking awesome questions. Um, thank you very much to for to Jackie and Chrissy for um, the planning of it. Um, yeah. And thank you to Chrissy for filming the animals for us. Thank you very much for everyone. Thanks for having us, Maggie and Jackie and Jeremy and Chris, uh, Chrissy and everybody. Thank you. Thank you. No problem. Right on. And so good night, everyone on YouTube and God bless. And, and we'll night, see you everyone. on Patreon, hopefully. A to record video stop.